Hi, I'm Dan Diebold. And I'm Jack Diebold. We, we are, are Diebold, Diebold Brewing Company. Company. We both started out as home brewers brewing batches 10 gallons at a time. When we decided to open a brewery, we went big and bought a brand new shiny 15 barrel system. Going from 10 gallons to 450 gallons is a big step up. And of course, there are a lot of unknowns, including, among other things, the cleaning processes and the different chemical requirements. We were little fish in a big pond, feeling pretty overwhelmed. Being new to the scene, most of our contacts and purchases were influenced by industry recommendations. The recommendation to use Burco was, and still is, the best piece of advice we have received. Shortly after we contacted Burco, we met Dana Johnson, Burco's brewery specialist. He walked us through our first chemical purchases, making recommendations based on our equipment, configuration, and capabilities. Dana was more than willing to forgive all of our newbie questions. Once our brew house was installed and ready to go, Dana showed up, donned a white lab coat, and proceeded to help us passivate all of our new stainless tanks. This absolutely blew us away and created the customer loyalty rarely seen in business these days. Since that day, we have continued to use Burco almost exclusively for our chemical needs. Our preferred cleaning process is Acid Bright No. 2 in breweries on the hot side and Ultra Niter in breweries on the cold side to knock down scale, beer stone, and keep our tanks looking clean and new. After a little over a year in operation, we won our first medal at the Great American Beer Festival for our Braggart's Brown Ale. And we no doubt have Burko to thank for allowing our recipes to really shine. Because all you taste is what we want you to taste. Regardless of size or volume, brewery cleanliness is paramount to quality beer. So we brew with confidence knowing our tanks aren't just clean, they're, they're Burko clean. clean. Hi, I'm Dan Diebold. And I'm Jack Diebold. We are Diebold. Oh my God, I goofed that.